with us? You'd have to be the stupidest fucking idiot I've ever met! Don't you know we weigh the fucking stuff? What do you think we don't fucking know how to count? You and your fucking skank whore are gonna pay for your stupidity! No, Tony! Please, Tony. Not Debbie. Please. Hey, you what, Clint? I'm gonna give you a chance to get out of here. What do you mean? Hey! Oh, fuck. Showtime. <laughs> this would be good. son to me. Steal from me and you fucking die.
I recognize that pain in the ass anyway. <laughs> you useless piece of shit. You get into Perth and don't call me till a week later? What's up with that? Hey, I'm a married man now. <laughs> yeah, 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 whatever. Shane Barrett, you must be Lisa. Lovely to meet you. But how did you know? Come and meet the ladies. Come on, baby. Cheers. Um, Cheers, Cheers. Cheers. So did all you guys serve together? Yeah, we sure did. We operated out of Kandahar. What was it like over there? I tried asking Daniel, but he wouldn't tell me a damn thing. It definitely had its moments, but other than that, it was awesome. Jenny must have saved our asses at least a dozen times. But who's counting? Yeah, she took more bullets than the both of us combined. Really? Yeah, well, not me, my helicopter. That must have been scary. No, not at all. Well, maybe just a little, but don't tell those two bozos. Well, I want to thank you guys for taking care of Daniel over there. Hey, Daniel took care of himself. He took care of me once or twice too. That's because you're always getting your ass kicked. <laughs> yeah, watch out for that Barrett. He'd be a real dumbass that time. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Zittle down. To us. So how you going, old timer? Hey, not so much of the old fella. I'll show you young fellas a thing or two. <laughs> Is that right? Very impressive, guys. What? What? I think I had a little bit too much to drink. You only had three. I don't know what I'm laughing. How are you so drunk? I'm not drunk. I only had like three. Sorry, man. Kiss me.
Mummy, can I have a milkshake, please? Oh, I think we can manage that. Yippee! Milkshake? What flavour? Strawberry. Oh, I think we can make that happen. Hello, darling. Your place are mine. Do we have something to drink at the pub? Sure. Two beers, please. Um, just a juice for me, thanks. Right you are. Are you serious? Maybe. It's left to wait for the test. Wow. Wow. So the other guy says to the other guy, just shut up. You're drunk. Go home. <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing. I have no idea. That's a terrible joke. I really don't know why I'm laughing. Tell you what, think about it. I'll be back in two things. Shirt for the bar, mate. Thanks, mate. No worries. Could you take care of her? Are you sure you don't want us to come with you? No, I'm okay. Thank you.
eventful evening. It sure was. You think you can mess with me, huh? You think you can mess with me? You're a dead man. Cockhead, don't you understand English? Help! Someone help me! Come on, boys, let's go. Help! And shut her up. Sorry, sorry. I'm sorry, baby. It's okay, really. I'm fine. No. It's not. You could have been. But I wasn't. We weren't. We're fine now. It's over. I was so scared. For those guys were going to kill you.
Those weak as piss cowards. You talk to the cops here? Yeah? I did. They don't seem very keen. Let's just see if they do their job, eh? I hear you, man. Believe me. I couldn't live with myself if anything happened to Lisa. I was doing all right, until that stone-faced bastard took me from behind. I know, mate. Shit do I know. Hey, listen. Me and Jenny are going to go into the range on Friday. If it makes you feel any better to come squeeze off a few rounds. I can still shoot. Well, let me know, and I'll open up a space for you. Yeah. Yeah, okay. I'm there. You take care, mate. You too. Fine. Let's do this. Ready? Let's go. people in my fucking nose. Be done with her. G'day, Mr. Wilson. And how are you on this glorious day? What have you fucking done to my wife? Nothing. Yet. Now write this down. 50,000 cash. 
11 a.m. tomorrow, the old abandoned road. Bring any of your friends, any police, and I blow her fucking brains out. You no one messes with us. Understand? Wait, wait, love inspector! Goodbye, Mr. Wilson. Oh! So, sweetheart, I hope your husband has half a brain in his head. Don't. Such a sweet thing. What a waste. Are you going to be okay? Are you going overseas? Just make sure you come back to me. Okay? That's 50 again. Third count. Right. That's that. Are you sure you don't want to call the cops? No. This ain't any cops, no killer. I'm not going to let them hurt Lisa. Look, mate. I know you're scared for Lisa, but you're not doing this alone. I said no cops, no friends! You know these fuckheads can't be trusted. We've always had each other's backs, nothing's changed. Shane and I will stay close. If everything goes smooth, fine. But if not, at least there's a chance of getting the both of you out there alive. Fair enough. Good man. We're a team. Don't forget that. We'll be close. Here's your money. Now let it go. <laughs> In good time, dickhead. Put the bag down and step away. Grab that and bring it to me, Frankie. <laughs> Just gonna count this, sit tight. Daniel, help me. I'm here, Lisa. <laughs> Lisa, Lisa, what are you two on your fucking honeymoon? Shut up, Frankie. Get your head in the game for fuck's sake. Get your hands off her! If you want her, come and get her. No! Fuck! Lisa! Lisa! No! Lisa! No! No! No!
You make me so happy, Lisa. I love you, Daniel. Hey, mate. Thanks, mate. I've been following up with my contacts. Shane, not now. Nah, it's fine. And they say the police have hit the wall. <laughs> They've got nothing. Bullshit. My contacts seem to think the cops don't want a ganger on their hands. So they're hushing it up. I don't fucking believe this! Daniel, calm down. Don't tell me to calm down! Lisa's dead! Those fuckers gotta pay! That's it! We're gonna take those bastards down now! I thought you'd want some payback. Count me in. You know I'm in. When do we do this? We do this now! Buy you a drink, gorgeous. Not tonight, handsome. But if you touch me again, I'll break more <coughs> of your arm. I know him. Tall guy with a busted nose. Yep, that's him. Fucking wanker. Why do you say that? He owes me money. Played this game of pool right for Grant. And when I beat him, he pulls a bloody gun. Tells me not to worry about it. He comes in Thursdays. Fridays sometimes. Every week. Mostly. I never like to catch his eye anymore, if you know what I mean. Thanks, mate.
these guys are, mate. They're taking their time. Yeah. Count five. Looks like a drug deal. How do you want to play this, Dan? We'll take the two on the right. I got the two on the left. I guess I'm stuck with the guy in the middle. You guys took your fucking time. Where's the shit, dickhead? It's right here, you fucking clown. It's good shit. Good shit, eh? So where's the fucking cash? What cash? We'll take it off your hands. Like fuck you will! Jesus. Fuck me. Party time. Don't move! Drop it, I die! Do as he says. Drop it! Don't you understand English? Get down. Now. You! By the car! Get out where we can see you! You're so fucking dead! I got this bloke covered. Do what you gotta do. Come on then. Come on. Let's see what that bitch really meant to you then. Come on.
Wake up, sleeping beauty. You're fucked now, asshole. It's over for you. All of you. No, that's where you're wrong. Fuck it. We're just warming up. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, that's got to hurt. The only reason why you're still alive is so you can take this message back to your boss. And what fucking message is that? Tell him to be ready. <laughs> ready for what? Fuck, knuckle. This! Now what? Yeah, Dan. What happens next? We take them all out. Do I? No, no boss. boss. Let's show this shit stain what it means to fuck with us. Harris, take a team and work this piece of shit over. Crush his friends. Rape his fucking parents. Any kids? Shame. I want these three pains in my ass dead. I want their friends dead! I want their family dead! I want everything about them fucking dead! Pony speech. Little over the top? Hey. So what are you waiting for? Move your asses! I want their fucking heads! Thirty rounds a night. I'm about the same. Got my revolver in the boot too if we need it. Any ammo for it? Yeah, I think so. I can later we drive into town, pick up something more compact. Good idea. Hey Dan. This. You should belong to my father. Make him unhandy. Say that again. You okay? I'm fine. You hit? Nah. They will miss the fucking losers. Let's get out of here before they come back. Good call. Thing they can't shoot straight. <laughs> Amen to that. Where's Sharon? Is she safe? Yeah, she's in Singapore. She'll be fine. That's good. We don't want her dealing with this bullshit. So, what now? Let's pay these assholes a visit. But if they're shooting us in broad daylight, that tells us two things. One, we're being followed. We can use that. And two? We can assume they'll try again. But this time, we can do something. You talking about a setup? Exactly. If they want us dead, they'll try again. But this time, we'll be ready for them. What's a plan, Shane? I'm thinking we need to turn the situation around. Set up some kind of ambush. Sounds good. Yeah. This is what we do.
Okay, you've got incoming. I think that plan of yours is a go. Shane, you copy? I'm making another pass, over. Loud and clear, Big Daddy. I have you on visual. See anything? Not yet. It's been almost two hours. Patience, my fearless leader. Yeah, easy for you to say. Here we go. I've got two bogeys approaching from the left, about 30 meters. Yep, got him. Are you sure there are guys you're looking for? One way to find out, show yourself. If they follow you, they're our guys. Copy that. Take him to the clearing so I can get a clear shot. They're taking the bait, but I don't see any weapons. I want this buff so bad I can taste it. Patience, mate. Stick to the plan. Roger that. Got my back. Have my way. Take cover, Dan. They're hot. Question, but let's just wait for Jenny. We know closer to getting them before they got Lisa. What's up? Ah, uh, Jenny, right on cue. Can you try and reason with them? We're getting shot at in broad daylight again, and I think Dan's sounding a little bit frustrated. We need a new plan. While you'll love this then, while you two were playing shoot him up, I was doing a little recon. Bloody hell. Dan, take a look at these. Is this what I think it is? Sure is. The gangster's hideout. Great work, Jen. Now we know how to take those bastards out. When do we start? Right fucking now! I'm done sitting down waiting for those assholes to get us. Okay, let's do this. I figure the way the place is laid out, with that sentry gone, it should be easier for us to get over to the garage area. Any patrols? No, not that I saw. Just static sentries. Got a mate of a mate who owns a hotel just outside of town. Got us a room so we can get some rest. One room? I can handle it if you can.
I hear you, brother. Get some sleep. I think we should all get some sleep, yeah. Bushlands in what appears to be a drug deal gone wrong, involving the prominent local gang known as the Lairs. Reports have recently arisen of potential rivalry between these two groups. All residents to the area have now been advised to take caution. Just got an idea. Olive leaf is being used to help prevent type 2 diabetes. We're looking for Jeremy. Come with me. Welcome to the Lairs. Not what you're expecting. So what brings you to our quiet little town? I believe we have a mutual enemy and we're here to help you take him down. Tony Vincent. What makes you think we need your help? Wait a minute. I recognise you. You were the one who had his wife murdered by an alleged gang member. It's all clear to me now. We're here to take those bastards down with or without you. Sell me. We know where they are, we've got a plan, and the element of surprise. What we don't have is weapons and people. I believe you're ex-military. There's no such thing as ex-military. Where? Afghanistan. Afghanistan? I'm going to need you to do something for me. Name it. Him. What about him? You have to beat him. <laughs> Say that again? in a fight. Let's do it. I've met a lot of people claiming to be military. Every one of them is special forces or whatever. I know more commanders than cab drivers. He's our best. If you can take him, you can have him. And which of us is going to fight? Him.
Well done. That's good enough. Right, your service. Jack, get Ashley. Show them the weapons. The both of you go with these guys. What'll it be for the lady? What about this big boys? Big boys? What's the plan? We'll brief you shortly. Boring! Jack, you get a plan, I'll pick a bomb. One sentry here, one over here, and about four men in the garage over here. Got it. Ashley and I will take the four at the garage. I'll take out this guard. I'll take out the other one. Good. That'll free us up to attack. And what will you be doing, gorgeous? I'll be heading for the main room to take Tony Vincent down. We all set then? We're good. We want payback just as much as you do. Mark and Neville were our good friends. Were those your friends that killed out in the bush? Executed, not killed. Yeah, I know, we were there. Killed two of them, but we let the shooter go. He's the one with the broken nose. So when are we doing this? Now. Let's kick some ass. <sighs> Good, let's go. Drink, bitch. Boys, boss, boss. 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 What the hell's going on, Hayden? I don't know, mate. These guys are fucked. Getting out of hand. We've already lost a tour on a couple of lads. I know, it's not good enough. Wilson's getting closer every day. And he'll be coming for us. Look, double the guard and make sure the fucking idiots do their job this time. Done.
Shane, Jenny, you go for those sentries? Jack, Ashley, go for the garage. I'm going for Vincent. Got it. Let's move.
Send this motherfucker now. Fuck you, Wilson.